Hey, hey, fish lovers. <clears throat> Check them out. They know I'm home. One of the wonderful things about having goldfish or fish in general as pets is look how excited and happy they are to see you. Yeah, you may not be able to snuggle up with them or play with them a whole lot. But they're happy and excited to see you because they're hungry and they know you're going to feed them. But they can't crap on your floor. Can't chew up your shoes. Can't do anything really to make you angry at them. They're just cute and fun and they all have their own little weird different personalities. Not to exclude you guys over here. I know you feel like the redheaded stepchild right now, but we're going to feed you too. One of the challenges of having the new tank is lifting that thing up. Propping it up with a book. Somebody gave me a good idea the other day. I just haven't gotten around to it. They said screw in uh, some handles on the front. I'm thinking about that. I haven't decided yet. A little pinch on both sides. Let's get those guys a little bit. That might have been a little much. Now they'll be all right. Now don't get me wrong. I love my dog, Harley. Wouldn't give him up for anything. But when it's cold in the winter or it's raining, these guys, they don't need to be taken out. They just need to have a little water change and a tank cleaning every now and then. They do pretty good. I don't know if you hear that sound of that water. My water level's a little bit low. I kind of sometimes like to keep it just a hair low so I can have that trickle sound. Because this is in my bedroom, that's where I sleep, and that's I've kind of gotten accustomed to having that trickling sound, that watering sound in my in my bed. Or while I'm sleeping. Tank's looking really clear today. I mean it's been looking really clear. When you see the little oxygen bubbles from having the low water level. But other than that, the water's really stays really clear. Of course, I do have the up in the corner here. That long piece right there is the UV sterilizer. I recommend it. This angel's looking nice and white. I think I have noticed that her crown or when spelled w-e-n and don't ask me why because i don't know i just uh i know for some reason it's called a win the same as that little brain looking thing right there but i think i'm starting to notice since i've been feeding this color enhancing food that that's getting a little more yellow than the white when I originally got it, but it could be a difference in the lighting. Mr. Jack Black. Anyway, that koi right there is just really pretty to me. I'm gonna miss it when uh, when we let it go. That's Savannah's koi. We'll have some good video of it. It's getting a little belly on it. It's pretty. Still the little nameless fish. Maybe we'll get to that uh, once I get the kids after tomorrow night. Get that one named. It's taken to the tank very well. 
There's that little Africa spot on the side. Kind of cool. Anyway, just a little update on the tank. And our little friends. Any uh, good leads on uh, some good online prices for ranchos? Please leave me some comments or links. I'd like to know it. I appreciate it. Thanks for watching.